Hey guys, it's Keep Calm and Game. Welcome back to Toko Mirage Sessions Sharp Fire Emblem. Now we're going back to the secret base, I believe. The secret base? Yeah. I don't remember the secret base. We weren't there yet. Oh. <laughs> right! <laughs> we got hit on by some older woman Which who is also fine is in charge. <laughs> I find I'm okay with this. Do you have a thing for Kugas? Chapter 1, A Star is Born. Oh. Dope bass. Hmm. A lot of posters of Kyria. She was strong. <laughs> Comparatively. Hmm. It's a, a lot, lot of disorganization. Wow, everywhere. I know those fucking some of that stuff is uh, is fucking Easter eggs on the magazines. Well, here we are. Looks more like an office than some kind of secret base. Well, yeah, it is an office. Duh, <laughs> dumb fuck, dumbass. <laughs> Ever heard of a Fortuna Entertainment? So your secret base is at the entertainment agency that runs Kyria? <laughs> Why? Oh, I know! That's the production company that Kyria belongs to! <laughs> is that her new voice? Yep. Okay, wonder who that is in the background. Uh, who's that? I don't know, man. These all people. More characters yeah. that come later? Maybe. Should have figured you'd know it, Subasa. But yeah, this is Fortuna Entertainment Office. Oh, good. <laughs> what? I have no talent. You're not talented at all. Just a regular production company on the surface, but secretly a team of Mirage specialists and investigators. Interesting. Why, why just not have them separate? That's Fortuna Entertainment. Uh, oh, and I haven't told you guys yet, but this is the production company I've been working with. What? You haven't told us shit. I don't know anything Jesus. actually about you, Toma. <laughs> it's not even like, you're not even my friend at this point. Why don't you tell us about it? Yeah, you don't have to worry about telling us where you work. <laughs> Man, I thought we were friends. Jeez, when you put it that way. If I knew you were working at the same company as Kyria, I could have asked you to get me an autograph. <laughs> That's what's important right now. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Mitsuki is me. I almost forgot. <laughs> That's what you're angry His about. Face, so, Tsubasa, <laughs> 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 I kept my mouth shut because I knew this is how you'd react. Too bad it turns out you're Mirage users now, so you're involved. Never mind that, Toma. So, maybe this is what isn't why they're together because her no her new voice is just you know obnoxious. <laughs> Hard to bear. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> oh, well, she's not here. Damn. Why not? She was in the other world, idiot. Get no, jeez. Subasa, chill out. Kyria's pretty busy with work right now. Being an actual idol. Not only does she have a ton of work, she's got to get ready for that live performance too. Oh. She's got her schedule worked out down to the minute. Even I haven't seen her for a while. God, what kind of schedule is she working if it's down to the minute? Like, I know idols get busy, but damn. Ellipses. Girl ellipses. Tsubasa jump. Tsubasa ellipses question mark. You okay? <laughs> I'm no. <laughs> Few, ha, few, ha, deep few, breaths. ha, few, <laughs> Itsuki ha. Likes the, Itsuki likes the deep breathing. <laughs> Just look at his face. Few, ha. In, out. In, 
out. What are you doing? <laughs> right now I'm breathing air that Kiria was breathing. Wow. Oh, I can die happy. What the fuck? I doubt it's the same air because air recycles itself. Don't crush my dreams. I'm sorry, but science! <laughs> Uh. Oh, right. There was someone else I wanted you two to meet. Is it your boss? Again? Because we've already met her. She's fine. Who's that? Uh, you'll see. They're waiting for you just past that door. Is it the velvet room? Maybe. I doubt it. That'd be interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Subasa, back to reality. <sighs> Phew ha. Phew ha. <laughs> Boy, I'm, I'm not done enjoying the atmosphere yet. It smells just like her. Even though I've never smelled her before. <laughs> yeah, I get to walk around. Cool. I'm gonna look at some of this shit. Because. What if I can zoom in? Check. The article reads, What is the seeker behind Yashiro Suru Surugi? The cool actor. For five years, his father has been missing. <laughs> That's... I want that to look secret? at those because... So I know I recognize some of the faces on there. But I can't now. I can't zoom in on them. Mm. Um, what Maybe if you walk in the opposite, like, way back there, it'll... If I can recognize something, I'm almost certain the second row in the very left is the um, is the sick guy from Persona 3. Mm. <laughs> I'm almost positive. That. I would. Who's that? It's a dude. Oh, TV. Much more important. Wait, that's not TV. It's a swastika. Shelves span this wall. It seems like a logical place to display trophies. <laughs> <laughs> really? Good. That's logical. Play records are logs of things you have accomplished while playing the... And awards are given based on complete certain combinations of play records. When you earn an award, its trophy will be added to these shelves for all to see. We suck, so we have none. Perfect. Oh. Admire the trophies, game. Yeah, which ones do we have? Like, none? Champion Itsuki. Subasa to the stage. Champion Tsubasa. Hmm. Toma to the stage. Champion Toma. Anything else? Have I not done anything? Maiko to the stage. Perfect. Uh, how many are these? Holy shit. <laughs> Balls, look at that. Invaded Illus Illusory Daitama. Okay. Let's let's look at trophies, Gabe. Let's see if you have any. Admire our trophies. trophies. We don't have any. <laughs> <laughs> look at all these look at all these trophies we don't have. Oh my gosh. The Wall of Fame. We're not good enough. Check. Food and drinks from shops and vending machines will fully restore all HP and EP. And that's nice. <laughs> wow. Huh. That's a really useful. A few drinks to choose from they each cost 160 yen. I have a shit ton of money. But I don't want to buy anything right now. You don't want a thirst tea or a macho milk? <laughs> a thirst tea? <laughs> hmm. What the? I can't leave. I even met the person Toma told me to see. They're behind that blue door that I'm running away from. I wonder if they have a large nose. Doubt it. But I guess they could. I mean, I mean, who am I to judge this game? Yeah. <laughs> or it could be, you know. A hot blonde girl. Like anything's, it wasn't pos four. anything's possible. Or it could be a redhead this time. Although I'm saving judgment on that until Persona 5. <laughs> what? Holy shit! <laughs> what? Besides, all residents of the Velvet Room have blonde hair, technically. <laughs> and about, whitish um, hair. Um, except for Marie, but she's not yeah. an original resident. Oh, okay. Well. Welcome to Legend of Zelda. Hmm. This uh, is not what I was expecting. No, I the like it. The Great Deku Tree, right there. <laughs> I swear, if a face starts talking to me like, shenanigans! 
Shenanigans. I don't see a person. What, what is this place? How is the place like this in an office building? Yeah, that's a good question there, Itsuki. Mind blown, right? This place is for Mirage Masters and those with strong performa. Those chosen by fate. <laughs> Who is it? This place. There's something about it that feels oddly nostalgic. Yes, me as well. I wonder why that is. Is this... <laughs> I don't know the areas in Fire Emblem, so I can't give my opinions. <laughs> Keida! Where have you been all this time, girl? I'm assuming they can't come out in the normal world. <laughs> She's been with you since we left the Idolosphere. You just couldn't see her, that's all. <laughs> She's been secretly But I could! <laughs> All creepily. But Toma matched that creepiness with his own creepiness. As long as they're in the Bloom Palace, though, they can go back to these physical forms. Is that what this place is called? Bloom Palace. <laughs> hey, it's TK! It's the green haired girl. You want to do a voice? Oh, big brother! I could do my Nanako impression, but I'm not going to. Do it! Because I'm shitty at do it. Do it! <laughs> huh? Why do I feel as though I've met her before? I can't believe it! It's the great idol Tiki, my favorite! I can't believe you're making uh, this little girl call you Big Brother. Wait a minute. I think I've seen her somewhere. Before. We've seen her in Daitama. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, it's Tiki, the Unaloid! The virtual singer, Tiki! <laughs> a, a, a real live Unaloid? Tsubasa's just an ultimate fan of all idols, isn't she? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, nice you're a fan, girl. <laughs> There's the reaction I was waiting for. And don't accuse me of that creepy shit. You noticed that first. You just, But you let her do it. That's the problem, Toma. I don't think he gets a choice. Look, let me introduce you. The Udaloid you two know is a cover. Tiki's true identity is a mirage. A mirage of who? One of the princesses, I'm guessing. Welcome to the Bloom Palace. <laughs> I was waiting for you, Big Brother. Sparkles. Big Brother? Wait, me too? <laughs> mm -hmm. If I'm not supposed to call Toma that, can you be my Big Brother instead? I can't wait for my face. <laughs> me. What a favor. Please. <laughs> I just want someone to call me little. <laughs> Okay, little. I don't mind. <laughs> well, uh, mm. go with I don't mind. I want to see what it does to the girl. I don't mind. You can be my sister. I don't mind. Yay! Yeah, Thank you, big brother. You might be overdoing it a little. Oh, thanks for telling me that Tsubasa was in danger back then. I didn't do anything worth thanks. That's all I could really do. Are you a useless mirage? I wish I could have gone to help, but all I can do is stay here and pray that everyone comes back safely. <laughs> she is useless. Oh my god. What do you mean by that? I'm a little different from the others. You're useless. I'm bound to this palace. Because you're useless. Wait, um, big brother, do Chrome and Keita still have their memories? No. They both said they have no idea why they're here. It sounded like they couldn't remember much. Why didn't you just ask Chrome and Keita that? <laughs> I don't know. I knew it. Wait a minute. Tiki, are you missing your memories too? Put I'm a dragon on your face! Dragon. <laughs> uh, 
I don't know why, but all Mirages have lost their memories of the past. Perfect. It's it's convenient plot, I'm sure. That that must be scary for you. I'm expecting plot from this. There's real plot, but it's just <laughs> Yeah. Hi. Hi. Ellipses. <laughs> Thanks for worrying about me, big brother. But I'm okay. We found Krom and Keita. Perfect. And you and Tsubasa seem like nice people. So I'm really happy. Well, that's because we're always laying with each other. So we're, we're in a good All the time. It's just, you know, <laughs> we're always. But eventually, happy. the sex will stop. And the, and the bad moods will begin. <laughs> I can only go a couple days. Damn it, Tsubasa! Oh I'm not a machine! <laughs> no, I'm in like a daze between. <laughs> oh. oh, Tiki, you're such a sweet girl. Fan girl. Sweat <laughs> pouring off her face. Can I, 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 can I, can I touch you? I never thought I'd be able to touch a virtual girl. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> he just made a really gross hand gesture. <laughs> <laughs> it's more. It was more like the hand gesture you go when you pet a dog under the chin. Uh, no, it wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I'll be sure to come visit you every day Weren't because I love my idols. Weren't you a little bit skeptical of going through that door originally? <laughs> but now it's okay. Yeah. Thanks, Subasa. Well, I think that about does it for introduction. Tiki, you want to give him an, ex an explanation on Unity? No, I understand Unity. I make games with it. Unity? <laughs> Unity? She's floating. Tiki? Yeah. yeah. You know you have Performa, right? Well, Performa is like the power of the human soul to express itself. Yeah. <laughs> We fuse Performa with people and Mirage to awaken new powers within them. That ritual is called Unity. Flowers! Does that mean we're not gonna have the shitty version of Falchion? Mm -hmm. Awaken new power? Mars Falchion? Hmm. Well, I guess you could just say it makes you stronger. Oh, so we will get Marth's. <laughs> I can't really fight like the other Mirages can, but I can perform Unity rituals for you here! Oh, so you're not useless. She does the fusion. Perfect. So let's perform Unity right now, okay? Um, you just had me call you Big Brother. You just asked to call me Big Brother, now you want to do fusion? I don't know. Yay! I don't know, I thought this game was rated E. <laughs> I actually don't know what this is Ready T. T. Oh, okay. So that's fine. Welcome to the Bloom Palace, the miraculous stage where Performa blossoms. Guess what, Big Brother? You can perform a new Unity. Holy shit! Holy shit! They're gonna combine. Wow! <laughs> that's called Carnage Unity. What? What? <laughs> Garnet Unity Carn is a ritual of fusing mirages with Performa obtained from enemies to change them into new Carnage. By performing Carnage Unity, more powerful Carnage can be acquired and new skills can be learned from them. This is an element that is a must to complete this game, so it's best that you make good use of it. Good. Wow, thanks for breaking the fourth wall there. You must use it to beat the game! You can't beat the game without it! Do this, Jin! I thought this was real life. Don't forget to check out the new Unity you can perform! Whoa. Hmm, should we ask about it or just perform it? Perform! Perform Carnage Unity! Go! That's the unity where Krom and the other Mirage's power increases and they transform into new kinds of weapons! So Mars Falchion. We'll see what happens. You'd be really happy if they do that. Hmm, which one? Do you want to just do Krom? Yeah, I want to see if they give him a I better think sword. We don't have one for the other one, so just Krom. Details of Carnage. Move the cursor onto the Carnage you want to learn more about and press Y to see the skills that can be learned from that Carnage. Or press X to check the details of Performa needed for it. Okay. Okay, so the Falchion... 
The Iron Sword. Hmm. Uh, skills. We you know. Um, oh, this like, would turn you into a bit more of a support. Yeah, I'd be able to get um. But you'd have electric skills. That sword looks way better. It's still stupid. Yes. Okay, so I guess that's. The so next wait, one. what are the? Yeah, I guess. We don't have these ones yet. Thanks. We need um. We need one of some. We need one of these two things, and we don't know what they are. So we haven't fought those enemies yet. Perfect. Well, it so looks we like Iron sword, sword is the only thing we can go to. Yep. I guess we'll do that one. Mm, yeah. Okay, so Iron Sword is this, right? Yes. Okay, let's perform unity. It's gonna be all flashy and shit. <laughs> No, Krom, come back to me! You are my best friend! I liked you more than Toma! Oh, crap. You know what that means? Huh? That means that we're still gonna have the shit falchion for whenever Krom's out. The new Carnage Iron Sword has been made! Even if you continue using a Carnage that you've inherited all skills from, you'll gain no new skills from it. If you have a different Carnage whose inheritance is yet to be completed, try using that one instead. Do you want to equip the Iron Sword we just made? Yeah! Yeah! By the way, your other ones are, like, maxed out. I don't know why they're not letting you equip them. I think, I, it's, I just think... I think it's just giving us the option right now for this one. Oh, okay. Itsuki Aoi equipped Iron Sword. Through the effects of Carnage Unity, the Mirage awakens to a new skill. Krom can now use the special performance Empty Wave. What is that? Gravity? Okay. Um, let me check actually. Um, where is it? Where is it? Mm. X details. Oh, I guess it's just different. It's not here. It might be hiding. Yeah. Oh. Or it could be passive. Yeah, maybe. Can we do this? We don't have the stuff for it. We don't have enough um, stuff for them. We need more materials. Mm. What should we do next? Answer any questions you have about you. Uh, come back when you find more performa. So that's her whole purpose is to do that. Okay. This is all I can really do, but I'm happy as long as I can help you all. Even if it's just a little bit. We're more than grateful for the help, Tiki. Great! I'll make sure you do to try to do my best. Downloadable content now accessible. Oh, so those my DLC um, missions are um, are now available. Cool, <laughs> which we can do later. Okay, so now what we do? I guess we just leave. We can talk to everybody here. Mm. A strange place indeed. If we can manifest here, this sanctuary must function similarly to the idolosphere. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Taking form in your world consumes quite a bit of energy. We'll stay here in the meantime, barring emergencies. <laughs> By the way, Itsuki, you will be fighting alongside Toma from now on, right? Ah. Yeah, to be honest though, I have almost no idea what I should be doing. Ellipses. Mm -hmm. In truth, I could say the same. My memories are still all a haze. I know I'm a mirage, but I can't even say for sure what a mirage is, let alone what I am. What I'm supposed to be, or what I'm supposed to do now? Kuroma. 
wrong. Mm. But if I stand by you, something tells me I'll find the answer. So I hope you can put up with me remaining at your side for just a bit longer. Ah. Of course, it's all right. Besides, I wouldn't have a chance against the Mirages without you. Here's to a long and prosperous relationship, Krom. Arigato. Thank you, Itsuki. It'll be a privilege to fight at your side. Ha! Gay! <laughs> Itsuki. You can usually find us here when things are quiet, but if you ever need us, we'll appear to help you. Okay. <laughs> Tsubasa. <sighs> First the Fortuna office, and now this big open space inside. My heart's pounding from all these surprises. <laughs> I can fix that. <laughs> <laughs> the Bloom Palace is a special kind of place, brah. So in here, the Mirages can show their actual forms. Surprised? <laughs> Got it memorized. <laughs> oh my god, bye. <laughs> hmm? Hmm. Um, Looks like Miss Maiko's back. My waifu? She said there's something she wants to talk to us about. So we'd better head back to the office. Is it a threesome? <laughs> You're going already? Sorry, I promise I'll come visit again. About a week from now. <laughs> Me too, I'll definitely be back a week from now. <laughs> I'll come with. Okay, I'll be waiting. Bye bye. Okay. Now, little dirty. There she is. What's up, girl? I can't move forward, can you? It's gonna sit up for the walk over. What's up, girl? Hey, trophy. <gasps> <laughs> Best debut performance. Acquire 5% of playback. Perfect. Damn it. I bet it's because we got the DLC. <laughs> it literally showed up after we got the DLC. Like the DLC became a rock. So yeah, probably. Damn it. Okay. Oh, wait. Does that mean you can change your shit now? Yeah, man. Yeah, you should be able to. Do I have, did my costumes unlock? Wardrobe. What the hell? Why are you here? <laughs> I don't know, but she's in love with you. She's close to us. Oh, and also the woman. <laughs> I was looking at the kid. Nope. Not yet. I don't think we can yet. I think, um, maybe later though. So what can you change? Equipment? I don't think we have equipment either yet, so... We don't have any other equipment yet either. So. Well, I mean, like, what was the DLC that you unlocked at that moment? Missions. Missions? Yep. How do you go on those? We gotta go talk to the green-haired girl. Oh, cool. There we go.